Nick Talma, Governor Wolf blasted the counties going rogue in a news conference this morning. Schuylkill County has now joined Dauphin, Lebanon, and most recently Lancaster counties to move into the yellow phase of reopening this Friday. Eyewitness News reporter Kevin Hayes is live for us tonight in Pottsville. And Kevin, what were some of the key takeaways from the governor's direct response today? Well, Nick, cowardly, unsafe, selfish, surrender, just some of the terms used by Governor Wolf in his morning press conference. And while he was actually praising many Pennsylvanians across the Commonwealth for their sacrifice during this pandemic, letting these defiant counties know that their decision to move preemptively into the yellow phase could cost them. To those politicians who decide to cave into this coronavirus, they need to understand the consequences of their cowardly act. Governor Wolf directly addressing the counties in the Commonwealth who have decided to go into the yellow phase of reopening of their own accord. These folks are choosing to desert in the face of the enemy, in the middle of a war that we Pennsylvanians are winning and that we must win. More than 3,700 deaths in the Keystone State, Wolf says while there has been a flattening of the curve, not staying the course is putting countless more lives in danger. The politicians who are encouraging the people they were elected to lead to quit the fight are acting in a most cowardly way. The governor also speaking directly to small business owners who have endured and sacrificed, saying they need to stay on board for safety. That's not only morally wrong, it's also really bad business. If a company, if a business chooses to open, they're not making a good decision uh, for their customers. And their customers need to know that. And that's what this is about. Now, district attorneys and prosecutors in these counties are all on board with not enforcing that order. But the state says it won't be so kind. I'm not going to uh, put up with, with uh, any politician any, anywhere in Pennsylvania um, jeopardizing the lives of the citizens of those counties. The message to be made clear where it hurts financially. The funding we have put aside to help with fighting this crisis will go to the folks who are doing their part. And that includes our CARES Act funding, which will be used to support counties that are following the orders to prevent the spread. Now, Governor Wolf clarifying that the money that would be withheld would be from discretionary fund accounts, not anything going to the medical field to help many of those still fighting on the front lines. And while scorning these defiant counties, also making sure that the message is clear, quote, the, mess or the, uh, the mission is to defeat this virus. If we don't do that, nothing else matters. Live in Pottsville tonight, Kevin Hayes, Eyewitness News. All right, Kevin, thanks for the update there. And Congressman Fred Keller firing back at Governor Wolf today in a statement. Keller says, quote, trying to feed your family is not cowardly. The vast majority of Pennsylvanians rely on their jobs to put food on the table. He adds, quote, the only person who has surrendered to the virus is Governor Wolf by constantly moving the goalposts and not allowing Pennsylvanians the option of supporting themselves. Reporter Kevin Hayes will have a reaction from struggling.